Hello everybody, Zachman18 here. Welcome to the next March Madness 2015 update. We are on number 6 now. It is March 22nd, 2015, uh, about 10.38 p.m. Um, I'm here to give you guys the remaining scores for the, uh, for the third round of March Madness leading up to the Sweet 16, which will be on Thursday. So there will be no March Madness games, unfortunately, tomorrow, Tuesday, or Wednesday. Um, but tomorrow, guys, I do want to let you guys know that Ben and I will be finally bringing back Borderlands 2 live tomorrow. We're going to be streaming tomorrow, and uh, we're going to see if we can try to get past a, a couple chapters or so. I don't know. We'll see. Um, also, um, I just got uh, I just scored really big on, on a $40 um, Steam key on eBay for the Telltale Games Winter Collection, um, which includes pretty much all their games they have on Steam um, as of today. Um, and that includes games like Game of Thrones, which I know um, my buddy Cam wanted me to play. Um, a much better graphic-wise version of Back to the Future, which we'll probably play again this year because it's 2015, which is the year of Back to the Future Part 2. So we'll probably be playing through that again, but this time on the PC. Um, so yeah, Game of Thrones, the Telltale version, as well as Tales from the Borderlands, which I'm going to play after... Um, ben and I beat Borderlands 2 since that since it takes place after Borderlands 2, and I also got Tales of Monkey Island, which I think I'm definitely gonna want to try out since I've been kind of wanting to play that for quite a while. Um, it also came with game came with games like Texas Hold'em and Sam and Max, which I'll probably maybe try out as well. So a lot of great games that came with this, as well as Jurassic Park. I don't know how well that game went, but. Um, so yes, the, the, uh, these games will be coming very soon, so I'm glad that I was able to score that. But anyways, let's get to the March Madness here. Um, so today we had West Virginia play against Maryland. Um, it, was a, it was a pretty tight game um, for the most part, but West Virginia ended up uh, having a better second half than Maryland and ended up winning 69-59, to 59, so they will be playing against Kentucky in the Sweet 16. Um, Next up, we have Wichita State against Kansas. Wichita State um, took the uh, took the upset for se uh, 78 to 65. So I was glad to see a cool little upset there. Um, that's also who I predicted uh, who might win because Wichita State. I mean, even though they're a seven seed, they are a great team um, nonetheless. Um, Wisconsin against Oregon. Uh, Wisconsin ended up winning uh, 72 to 65. It did get very close, and I was I was thinking maybe Oregon could have pulled off the upset and then and. Uh, a pack, uh, one of the pa that Pac-12 team can actually move on to the Sweet 16, but nope, Wisconsin will uh, Wisconsin won. So I'm not happy or sad. Um, so, anyways, um, next up we have let's see, um, Iowa against Gonzaga. Gonzaga won 87 to 68. Pretty simple game there. And then we had Duke against San Diego State. Once again, pretty simple game there. We had uh, 68 to 49. Uh, Michigan State against Virginia that uh, went to Michigan State 60 to 54, um, which was another upset, which was pretty surprising. Um, and there's two more here: Dayton against Oklahoma. Um, Dayton was doing pretty good for the most part, but uh, Oklahoma, uh, similar to the West Virginia Maryland game, uh, Oklahoma just had a better second half, so um, they ended up winning 72 to 66, ending Dayton's uh, pretty strong run that they had. Um, I think they did mention that last year Dayton made it into the Sweet 16, but it uh, looks like not this year. So, um, And then finally, uh, the University of Northern Iowa, or UNI, went up against Louisville, and Louisville ended up winning 66-53. So that is the scores of the eight games for today, and now I will um, tell you guys the Sweet 16 teams. We have Kentucky, West Virginia, Notre Dame, Wichita State, Wisconsin, North Carolina, Xavier, Arizona, Gonzaga, UCLA, Utah, Duke, Michigan State, Oklahoma, Louisville, and North Carolina State. That is your Sweet 16. Um, so the Sweet 16 will be taking place from um, the 26th through 27th, I believe. Um, so it'll be Thursday and Friday. Um, I'm assuming they're going to have um, eight games one day, eight game. Uh, yeah, that's what it is here. Yeah, so. Um, Four games, I should say. Four games one day, um, four games the other day, uh, for a total of eight games, and eight times two is 16, so <laughs> a little bit of math involved there. Um, so on March 26th, we will have Kentucky against West Virginia, um, Notre Dame against Wichita State, Wisconsin against North Carolina, and Xavier against Arizona. 
And then on Friday, we, we will have um, North Carolina State against Louisville, Oklahoma against Michigan State, Duke against Utah, and UCLA against Gonzaga. So that'll be the two 316 games Thursday and Friday. And then it'll be the regional finals in which uh, they'll, they'll be playing in the same areas that they did in their um, appropriate regions. Um, so the Midwest is going to be in Cleveland, West will be in Los Angeles, East will be in Syracuse, and South will be in good old Houston. Um, and then there'll be the national semifinals, and then the final four, and then the national championship. So uh, we're, um, we're 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 a little. I think we're just about halfway through March Madness. So um, these games are going to start to get a lot better. So, uh, but unfortunately, we're, uh, they'll be taking a three-day break, obviously, to get to their uh, to get have the teams get into their uh, proper locations of playtime, I guess. Um, and we'll see what happens Thursday and Friday. So you guys won't be seeing another update until. Um, Thursday, so um, hope you guys all, all had a great weekend. Um, sorry about the dislike issues we've been having. Um, that, that'll probably be carrying out into this week. Um, but uh, you guys can still give this video a big thumbs up, and I will still see it, and it will uh, still help out tremendously. Uh, you guys can also hit that subscribe button, and that will um, bring me a great amount of joy for the spring break. And uh, let me know what you guys are doing uh, for spring break. I'd really like to know. Um, but otherwise, guys, stay tuned for uh, Borderlands 2 Live returning tomorrow um, along with uh, the next episode of Minecraft Mondays. So thank you all for watching. And uh, I'm Zach 18 and I will see you guys next or er, this Thursday for the next March Madness 2015 update on the first day of Sweet 16. And I will see you guys tomorrow for Borderlands 2 Live and Minecraft Mondays. Minecraft Mondays will probably become uh, be coming first. So... Thanks for watching, everybody, and good night.